Welcome to Gord Field here in Detroit Rock City, home of the Motor City Maniacs. I see the Maniac fans are trying to get the fire wave going, <laughs> but so far just a small number of fires and mostly just on the upper deck. Yeah, they really stepped up security, Grim. In the men's room earlier, I only witnessed three random assaults and two of them were on me. <laughs> Not bad for game day. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The New York Tyrants go up against the Motor City Maniacs. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. I'm a house Welcome to another game day here on the MFL Network. Grim Blitzrow along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan. How you doing? Great city, isn't it, Bricks? Fantastic city. My motel even has free color TV. Oh, that's and nice. an ice machine that works. Wow. There was police tape blocking the bathroom because of the photographers in there, but other than that, no complaints. They, they give you free jelly at breakfast, too. Sounds like a real winner. its target a pickup of six yards on the play oh uh, come on that was a cheap shot <laughs> that's why i love this guy and so are the fans and that'll be second down and four so hard I went into a dark tunnel thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the line turns out it was just the visitors tunnel that he knocked me into and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face and it's first and ten to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. It was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but... What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? That's a touchdown saving tackle right there. And it's first and ten. Blasts it and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have... Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that 
Red Mutant Bingo! All I need is 77 to bite it! First and ten. And the running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. And another interception. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. warming up. on that one and he was just starting to pick up some speed hey Tim, i know a guy if that's what you're after second down and six and i've had it i'm running out of excuses for this qb you just ouch what is this annie's wrestling point but you never know with kickers <laughs> the kick is good as expected those are pretty much just gimmies they need a good return here to set up the offense and that 
wants a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. <laughs> First and ten. With the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. Second down in a very lot. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Third down and, well, good luck. And this guy is supercharged with electricity. Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. The 10. He's running out of gas now. Listen to his fans howl. They love him. He came up with a teenage werewolf in the mutant farm league. I don't know if he's dancing. I just marked it in territory. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. He 
Rogers, I'm taking you with me. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Oh, 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 I can't it. <laughs> oh, oh. The offense lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. They're lucky to have survived so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. It's first and ten. Oh, he's gone berserk. The ball carrier better walk. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 90.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Crap. And that'll be second down and four. in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Third and four. He picks up a two. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Oh, with a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. And the defense calls a Strawberry Fields dirty trick. Now this takes me back to those crazy days of my youth. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Second down and six. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes us. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch! Second down and more. And the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Second down and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And that's another pick. Man, oh, man. Boom! First and ten. Six yard gain there. That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do solid pickups more often. I step in dog turns on my front porch every day. And that'll be second down and four. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. First down in a mile. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven.
Second down in a very lot. And he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And it plays a defense, schmuck. Third down and long. Sometimes the defense thinks they're helping out in their own special way. And he's going to have to boot this one halfway to hell. He's got the distance, and the kick is good! They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. I gotta see that one again. It was also freaking awesome! I hope they have raincoats in the front row, because that was splattering everywhere. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than that. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but... I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. That pass play nets them seven yards. Oh, no. I got the hiccups again. What are you supposed to do? The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. No good. Now that punter's gonna fight, and he just lets that one go. He says no, thank you, and the defense downs it. And it's first and ten.
The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And it's first and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And it's a warp speed dirty trick. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. Oh, with the brain scrambler. First down and nine. Trying to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And he breaks away. First and ten. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. Pow! With the brain scrambler. First and ten. Second down in a very lot. down and the punter is warming up at this 
point with multiple interceptions. He, and he just slipped away like a greased pig. Boom! Hmm. I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned MFL rule. Three. Defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> First down and one. This is your brain. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, Good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. running back no rest for the weary the last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die you know this shouldn't be easy but with kickers you never know the kick is good and as expected those are pretty much just gimmies they need a good return here to set up the offense He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players would catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Oh, man, what a throw. That sonic blast just cleared the field for the receiver. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. <laughs> Supercharged and can electrocute any opposing player he touches. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! And they line up for the extra point. right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! And it's first and ten. up five on that play. I know I said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. Second down and five. Shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. Don't 
you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And that'll bring up second and one. Coverage. Nice deflection. And that'll bring up third and one. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. He's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. Wasn't he Briggs? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Well, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crack their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they're not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? Throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? And he bursts into the end zone for the score! What a run! Well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Punched his way out of that, and with another pick, the QB says, I don't know almost throw interceptions, but when I do, it, ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Hey, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? Huh? right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Picks up a new set of downs. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. And it's first and ten. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. Oh, great play by the defense. 
The receiver didn't stand a chance. Third down and 10. takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. That ball was almost intercepted. Second down and ten. Down to seven. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. And this werewolf is from London, I believe, signed in the offseason. Yeah, I saw him at Trader Dick's hotel party the other night. His hair was perfect. Better watch out. He'll rip your lungs out, Bricks. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. First and ten. and watch his confidence tape. Ref that just called that penalty? He was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. Yeah, that sounds like a good job. Lord. He's right at home here taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swiping money from the bathroom attendant. Yeah, who don't do that? And it's first and ten. They could not connect on that play. Second down and ten. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Yeah, I'm still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah. It was close, though. Yep. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours.
crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. And the defense spiked the offensive water with Strawberry Fields. And now they can taste sound but can't remember what the concept of time is. Second down and more than the QB would like. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. And they'll bring him third down and seven. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> the offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Win, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the funeral expenses, that is. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutiny. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. And there's another pick. And the oh, what the brutal hit! And it's first and ten. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and ten. That's a two-minute warning. You know what that means, right, Bricks? Yeah, take a giant whiz and get in a fight in the men's room. Ghost. Second down in a lot. The quarterback is getting mauled out there. The defense calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. At this rate, the QB is going to have more understand what a hit that was. <laughs> the quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get. 
get something going here. And it's first. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just cock blocked the clock. And the offense goes into the hurry up formation to try to conserve time. Great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. The quarterback burns his last time out. He can't stop the clock anymore. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And another interception. This quarterback is... Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. Second down and six. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a he zigged when he should have zagged and ends up a shish kebab. Brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...